Actually, <laughs> magicians use sleight of hand to misdirect audiences while performing their amazing feats, but not internationally renowned magician Joshua J. Yeah, in his new show, Look Closer, which debuted at the Rhapsody Theater last night, he's encouraging fans to take a fresh look at what magic can be. Look Closer, yes. new show here at the Rhapsody. And I like this, it's so interesting because you want people to get in close and see what you're doing. That's right, this is a magic show unlike any other because we're encouraging people to look closely, to see things right under their nose. So do you want people to figure out and see how magic works or, no, okay. No, no way, I hope not. Okay. That's, we've designed the magic to be better when you're looking closer and to change the perspective. All right, so how, how is it gonna change this perspective? Explain to me, because I'm always just amazed by the speed of hand and the sleight of hand. Yes. And so. Let me show you. Okay. Can I show you? Yes, you can. All right, so we're gonna try, you ask specifically, and I love this, she asked about how can we change the perspective? How can we look closer? Yeah. So people always wanna know, what if I was right on top of the trick? You're about to be right. right on top of the trick. Every time I do this trick, I lose a card. Look, I only have about half the deck left. Okay. So I'm going to lay down on the ground okay. so that we can change the perspective. Okay. And if I lay down this way, okay. you stand right here. Can you guys see that all of these cards are different? Yes, All I right. see different colors and different suits. So I'm gonna look away, and when I look away, with me on the ground like this, okay. you're just gonna call stop. Okay. Stop. Can you see a card? I sure can. Okay, let's, I wanna show it to the camera, but I'm not gonna look. Okay. You got it? Take one more look. Okay. Take the cards in your hands. Now, you're gonna do a trick for me to change the perspective. Spread them out like it's a pick a card trick. Okay. Watch this. This, is now your card. Thank you guys very much. Okay. Now to prove that that's the card, I want you to deal those cards, dropping them one by one on my face. Stop when you get to the one you picked. Uh, face up or face down? Face up, so okay. you can see them. Just drop them one by one, yep. <laughs> this is the most enjoyable, weird part of the show. Okay. You stop when you get to the card. Okay, so people get to just throw things at you at this show too. Now we're looking closely. Yeah. Uh-oh. And you saw it in there, right? Stop it! It's gone. It's gone! Now look, this is the card. Take this card and tear a little corner off. Now where's the card and where's the corner? I can't tell. Uh, this is the corner. That's the corner. Take the card, throw it away. Take that corner and place it right there. You guys see that? Now hold your hand palm down. Okay. Yeah, a little closer to me. Yeah, like, like this. Okay. Like this. Watch. Lift your hand. What the heck? Now, I promised you a different perspective. Is that the card you picked? It is the card I picked. But that's not the trick. The trick is a change in perspective. Where's the, um, where's that program you were holding up? Look. Inside the layers of this card, do you see some outline yes. of something? There's something inside the layers. Let's see. Do you have that piece? I do. Look, every piece of paper is made up of two layers. This Stop it. is a perfect match, and now you guys get to see a trick where you're looking closer. Thank you very much. Oh my gosh, and I held that program and it was a normal program. <laughs> I, I can't explain it. Oh my, so you were coming off a, an amazing tour. You, this, yes. is, this is another stop on an amazing tour. Yes, started in, at Carnegie Hall uh, mm -hmm. two months ago. Then we were in New York for a month, then I took it to Latin America for two weeks, and now we're here in Chicago. And you're here in Chicago for a few weeks, correct? Yes, I'm here for the whole month. For the whole so month. You, every weekend, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, even a matinee show on Saturday. Um, so there's plenty of time to catch the show. How did you hone these skills and where did you learn all this? I saw David Copperfield even give you props. Yeah, yeah, it was very kind. Um, I've been doing it since I was seven years old. My dad got me into magic, uh, showed me a trick and didn't tell me how it was done and I've been doing it ever since. Wow, it is so cool. Well, welcome to Chicago. We're so Thank glad to have you much. here. Awesome stuff here at the Rhapsody Theater. Yeah, you can catch Josh at the Rhapsody Theater in Rogers Park through April 28th. Catch him on Instagram at Joshua J Magic. 
or magician, excuse me, or pick up any of the six magic books he's also <laughs> written. Six? Uh, yeah. So and you were that close and you still can so, figure like, it out? So he, I picked the card. He didn't know the card. Somehow managed to get it ripped and get it back in the program that I had. Uh-huh. Bizarre. That was off over here? Yeah. Wow. Isn't that crazy? It's a great show, guys. Yeah, Gotta go check that out.